We're going to do this alphabetically. Our first young lady is known by many, many names around the league. Aratakis, Ariatikis, all kinds of things. But it's really Sarah Aratakis. Is she around? Sarah, there we go. Sarah graduated from Troy High and has swum from Beachwood for nine years. She will attend the University of Michigan and is also a graduate of Troy High School. She has swum from Beachwood for 12 years. She will be attending Augustana College in Troy High. She has swum from Beachwood for eight years and she will attend the University of Michigan. She was a four-year varsity swimmer at Troy High, played varsity lacrosse for three years, and was a ski club member for three years. Christy was also a national he is a graduate of Seahawks High School. She's been on the team for eight years. She plans to attend Western University, Western Michigan University this fall. She is a member of the National Honor Society. She was active in Habitat for Humanity and traveled to the Grand Canyon. Kristen is a Troy High graduate and she has swum for Beachwood for eight years. She will attend Michigan State University. She was a member of the National Honor Society. She swam for Troy High and was on the girls lacrosse team. <laughs> Sarah is a graduate of Troy High, and she has swum at Beachwood for 12 years. She will attend Western Michigan, where she plans to study elementary education. Sarah was honored to go to eight finals once when she was seven years old. At Troy High, she was a member of the swim team. She's played recreational soccer since first grade, and also helped teach first graders in her church, qualifier to Hunter Crestor. Aaron swam for Seal High School, was captain of Seahawks water polo team, and is a member of the National Honor Society. Jackson. Paul is a graduate of Troy High School. He has swum from Beachwood for 11 years. Next fall, Paul will be studying mechanical engineering and helping Purdue win its first national water polo championship. Paul is a member of the Troy High School All-State and All-Beachwood 400 free relay. He was also a two-time All-State water polo selection and was the leading scorer in the state of Michigan as a senior. He was selected to participate in the United States National Water Polo Selection Camp in Los Alamitos, California. He was captain of the Troy High Swim and Water Polo Team. Paul is also a member of the National Honor Society and a four-year scholar athlete. He was an assistant coach of the girls water polo team. Paul was also an Oakland County Special Olympics swim meet volunteer. In 1998 and 1999, Paul received Troy Youth Assistance, Youth Recognition Awards, and Congressional Recognition Awards for community service. His favorite Beachwood memory was being a contributing member of Beachwood's first A Finals champion in 1993. Paul's advice to young Beachwood swimmers is, don't be afraid to set ambitious goals because if you work hard and try your best, you can and will achieve it. Also, remember to be first in line for the pancake breakfast. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. Good. Sarah Massaro. Sarah is a graduate of Seho High School. She has swum for Beachwood for 12 years. She will attend Western Michigan, where she plans to study elementary education. Sarah has placed in A finals for many years. She was a YMCA only national team member and a four year varsity swimmer for 14 years. Kevin will be studying architectural engineering at the University of Colorado Boulder. Kevin was also a member of Troy High All-State 400 Free Relay. Since Paul mentioned this, we'll explain that was Paul on Black 2, Kevin on Black 4, Chris Thomas, who's not old enough to be a senior yet, and Todd Webster, who unfortunately is 19 under league rules and we can't use him. Kevin was captain of the swim team. He also played varsity soccer, was a member of National Honor Society, and a four-year scholar athlete. Kevin had numerous volunteer activities which included St. Thomas More and helping coach a youth softball team. His favorite Beachwood memory was winning A finals for the first time. Kevin would like to give this advice. When you put the work in, you'll get more out of it.